Brandon here again. We're doing lightning reviews today. I got the same drink. It's the kombucha. It's delicious. It's hibiscus healer with cranberry and blueberry. Ooh, ooh. <clears throat> but we are going to be reviewing the MacBook Pro sidecar. Um, the new MacBooks don't have any ports on the side. They just have two USB-Cs and that's it. Or I think they have a headphone as well. But that's a problem when you've got a lot of old accessories like regular USBs, SD cards, whatever. So they came up with this little thing that clips onto the side and it's pretty sweet. Check it out. All right, as you can see there, this is what it looks like when it's plugged in. It's this guy. There's an HDMI. This is the USB charger. This or USB-C, excuse me. USB-C. I've got an external hard drive back there. There's a regular SD, a micro SD two USB, uh, I think they're A's, whatever the old style, the regular one is. Um, got a mouse and a, another external hard drive. So it's great. If you want to have dual monitor set up, um, plug in a bunch of different things at once, this is the way to go. Um, they do make a bigger version as well with a dual HDMI output and a couple other things, but for most people this is probably going to be enough. The biggest problem I have with it is that this plastic piece, it can come off, I'll show you in a second, but when it's on, it's the most stable, so obviously if you're kind of moving stuff around, it doesn't wiggle, but you can't close this, which I think is a pretty bad design. So, let me just exit out of my, or, uh, excuse me, eject my hard drives here. Off, just so you can see. So there it is. Hyperdrive is the brand. This piece comes off. That magnetizes on there. Cool. And that also is ambidextrous. So if you have the air, I believe the MacBook Air is on the other side. So if you went like this with it, you can flip it and then you can flip this as well to match there. So it is ambidextrous and so is this, which is the whole point of the new USB-C, which is pretty cool. Um, so yeah, if you did plug this in without that piece, it still works, but it is a little more wiggly and if you have tighter cords, it could put some stress on there. So I believe this is just to relieve that stress. Not sure exactly. I guess there's no other way to do that without infringing on where the MacBook closes. But if you don't put that piece on there, the MacBook definitely can close, no problem. Um, yeah, and that's it. I mean, super simple. I think it's about a hundred bucks. It's pretty expensive, but uh, you almost need it to work with your Mac. That's all they give you, and most of us, like me, don't have any new USB-C accessories unless it came with this. That's the headphone jack on the other side. So yeah, all in all, um, I'm actually selling this one because they just came out with a dual, and I would like a triple monitor setup, but uh, I'm not selling it because it didn't have any, you know, it didn't perform well or anything like that. It also comes with this nice little faux leather case to drop it in and then an extension. I'm not sure why. I guess if you, I don't know. I don't, this doesn't make any sense to me. I'm sure it charges fast if it doesn't have both of them. I, I don't know what the deal is, but uh, kind of weird. Other one, the way they circumnavigated all this was just that it has two ports and then a wire, and this thing will actually sit over here. That's the dual HDMI port one I'm talking about. Um, so some people might like that better to just tuck everything behind or underneath or wherever. It's not very long, but yeah. Cool. Thanks for checking out the video. I'm sure there are other versions. Different companies make different stuff, um, but in terms of matching the macbook finish the space gray the it looks like apple made it you know they did not it's third party but 
it looks perfect. Some of the other ones are clunky. I've seen like sidecars that are, almost look like an external hard drive. It's, you know, just definitely not as sleek. This is the sleekest one I've ever seen. Um, but yeah, appreciate you guys. You know what to do. Like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, check out some of my other videos. I'm doing a few reviews today, so if you're into that, let me know. Kind of testing the waters on the reviews. We'll see how it goes. Appreciate you guys. Until next time, peace.